friends welcome back to my channel thank you so much for being here i really appreciate it in today's video i have what is kind of a surprise wantable box to share with you all right so why is this wantable box a surprise to me I had kind of stopped ordering the boxes, the special boxes that they come out with a couple of months ago because I've been struggling my last few Wantable boxes, finding really anything that I was really excited about or I thought was my style. And so I thought I would just kind of pause for a moment. And then I had completely forgotten that I have in there in my Wantable account a subscription to get a box sent to me. I think it's every three months. So I got the email that my edit was being styled and decided that I would just go ahead and keep this and let it come and see what was in here. And I will tell you, it was a surprise for me because this is the very first time I received a preview from Wantable. We know that Stitch Fix always sends you that preview where you can pick items and I can't even remember how many items there were to choose from in the preview, but it was quite a lot. But I have to tell you, I rejected every single thing. It was like so many pairs of jean shorts and I'm just not ready to be doing shorts yet. It's just early spring here where I live in the Midwest and shorts are not something I'm really looking for at this moment. So I rejected everything and said, I would really just like some spring tops. Like that is what I would like to focus on. Like tops to transition to spring or short sleeve tops. That is really what I would like to see. So I'm really curious to see what is in this box to see if they did send me some short sleeve shirts for spring. So let's go ahead, we will get into it. Let me see what Wannable said. All right, here is my very large bundle. So I apologize because I know that the intro to this video has been a little chatty. So I am gonna put up the time that the try-on starts right here. So, so if you wanna jump right over to the try-on portion, feel free to go to that time. But for everyone else, here is my first piece. And this is Skies Are Blue. And this is a pleated bright pink cami. I'm not sure if it's the pleats are showing up on, I think you can see it there. So yeah, it's a bright pink pleated cami. I love the color. The second piece we have is a West Key. Oh, this is cute. It's like a faux wrap, long sleeve polyester blouse, but I really love the colors and the, the paisley pattern. It's like a bright orangey red. That could be cute. The next item we have, this is a Love Appella top and it's this pretty green and it's got a little bit of like ruching at the shoulder and then at the waist it has this smocking elastic. The next piece we have here, this is a, a B. Young. This is a light blue open front cardigan. It's really very, it's pretty long too. It's a pretty blue color, it's very soft. Next we have a thread and supply. This is a navy jacket. I think that I liked this on the stream. I think this is a cute navy jacket. All right, we've got some green jeans here. <laughs> These are Lola, a high rise jean. And the length is very concerning because they look like they're really wide leg and not long enough. It's like a lime green, like stretchy jean. I am not sure what I think about these, but we will try them. And then the last item, this is a pair of Dear John jeans. It's cute they have the double fly here, the double button fly. Once again, these are a wide leg too with this really like wide hem at the bottom. I don't know length looking at these if they're going to be long enough. I will be right back with the first few pieces to share with you. Okay friends, I am back with, I've tried on a couple of pieces to show you, but I am just going to hold up this first top which is a 
pleated bright pink cami and I'll be putting the information up here on the screen as I'm showing it to you. It's a very cute like dressy type cami. I'm not feeling comfortable trying it on right now. I'm getting my heart checked out and I'm wearing a little portable monitor and I just don't really want to put this on and have that all exposed. So I am not going to be trying this on for you today, but really a pretty color. It's just kind of a little bit on the dressy side. And I realized that I bought a bright pink cami from Wantable last summer. That's almost the same exact color. So I really don't think I need another dressy cami, but this is a cute one, but I know that I will be sending this one back. All right, I have stepped back to show you. We're going to start with the jeans first. And I'm happy to report that the length is good enough with these. But I'm not sure I'm crazy about these on me. I see a lot of people, I know the wider leg jeans are really in style. And some women just look fabulous in them. I just don't know if I find them flattering on me. I just feel like because I kind of carry my weight here in my stomach and in my middle that also having legs that are really wide like this just make me look bigger. I don't know. I'm going to have to watch the footage, but initially I am not crazy about these jeans. They are like high rise. They come up well over my belly button and they too, they have the two buttons here at the fly. And honestly, I'm hating the back view with my flat butt <laughs> with these jeans. I don't think they're at all flattering on my booty, so that's something. Like I said, the length of these is definitely long enough, so that's a good thing. But they're just really wide, and I know it takes getting used to a new jean style, but like I said, I just don't know if I'm feeling these on me. I just, I, I'm curious to see how these are gonna look on the footage to see what I think then, but initially I'm thinking these are not going to be a keeper. All right, and now we will go on to this top. It's really, really soft t-shirt fabric and like this sagey green. And it does have this like gathered detail up here at the shoulder. But I'm finding that I don't think this is very flattering on me either. It has this smocking at the waist but I'm just not sure how to really wear this and I feel like it's just kind of adding more to my stomach area. I don't know, there's just something about it that when I was looking in the mirror, I just, I was not loving. I mean, it, it's a cute idea. Someone else, it may be really adorable. On me, I just don't think it's doing much. All right, but now I wanna try on this really cute navy thread and supply jacket and see how this looks on. So it does have flat pockets here up at the breast, and it also has faux flat pockets here. Like you can't access the pocket from the snap area, but it does have the pockets here where you come in at the side. I will say I'm happy the length of the arms on this one actually fits me, so that's a good thing. And then it does have the zipper closure underneath the snaps. So I don't know, I didn't even look at the mirror upstairs. This is the first time trying it on. So I'm really kind of curious to see how this looks on and see if I like it. I, I could definitely use another spring jacket. And like I said, I don't have a navy. So depending on how I like this on and the price, this could be a possible keeper. All right, and zipping right along, I'm gonna just try this cardigan over this top just to see what I think of this one. All right, so I'm stepping back. This is a really cute sweater. I love the blue. It feels very nice. It's got the ribbed cuff. It does have some pockets here. They have the threads like sewing them across right now that you could cut if you purchase them. I think it's a cute cardigan, but I have to tell you, I feel like I'm kind of getting tired of this style on me. I've got so many of these already in different colors that I just don't know if I want to add another one. I mean, there's nothing wrong with this sweater. I just don't think it's a love for me. So I'm pretty sure this will be going back. All right, so I've got still a few more pieces to show you. I will be right back with those. All right, I'm back with this next West Key top. 
And I think there's a lot of cute things about this. I'm really curious to watch the footage back to see how it looks on from that perspective. But it is just your basic polyester blouse. It does have elastic here. It's a three quarter sleeve. And I will say this is a little bit tight and this is gonna be one to definitely leave marks. So, so that is something that detracts from it right away is that I, the elastic is a little tight on my arms. But I think the pattern is really cute. I like this like orangey red with a little bit of like blue. I, I guess you would call this paisley. That's what I'm calling it. It does have this faux wrap in the front and it does have a little modesty stitch right here. And I believe it is actually a little bit longer in the back too. So I don't know, I'm gonna have to Maybe try this on with a pair of just straight leg jeans that I own because I'm not sure if I like these jeans with this, if that's maybe detracting from the blouse. Maybe I should try it on with a pair of jeans that I really like and see how it looks then because I do think it's a cute top. So I'm really curious, what are your thoughts on this one? What do you think of this West Key top? I don't know, I'm gonna have to give this one some thought. All right, I believe I've got the green jeans left. So those will be interesting. I will be right back with those. All right, friends, so I do have the very light green pants to show you. And I decided not to try these on with any of the tops that were in the box because I thought they would just really clash. So I just pulled out a white tee to try these with. So this is my own, this was not in the box. But let me step back so you can see the length of these. Now you can see on me, these are definitely cropped and whether they are supposed to be cropped or not, I am not sure. I am thinking that they are not. This length would probably be cute with sandals in the spring and summer, but I'm just not crazy enough about these pants anyways. So let me just show you a few of the details. So these are a very high-waisted pair of pants. And I will tell you, there is so much stretch in these. I mean, they have a lot of stretch. And the pockets are a little bit different. You can see there's a button here at the top that you can open, and then the pocket is pretty deep. And then it also has this like seaming detail that comes across the thigh. And I will tell you, the rear view, not good with the flat butt at all, not good at all really not crazy about the rear view in these jeans. These are just definitely not a pair of pants that are flattering on me. All right, so friends, I am gonna go ahead and change now, and then I will be right back to do a wrap up and see if there's anything that I'm gonna be keeping from this wantable box. All right, friends, we are back for the wrap up, and I am looking at the prices for the first time and trying to decide what I'm gonna do with this wantable box. All right, so this top here, I really was trying to make work. I really like this color so much and this paisley pattern. I, it just, this is making me happy, the coloring of this one. But I have to be honest, when I'm trying this on with other jeans that I own, I just don't think it's that flattering on me. And if I were to keep this, this would probably be one of those ones that would hang there in the closet because every time I would go to wear it and try it on, I wouldn't feel good and I would take it off and then end up donating it in a few months with the tags on probably. So I think I'm gonna let this one go, although I, w I really did like this and I think maybe on the right person, this could be really adorable. And then I am really seriously debating this thread and supply jacket. How much is this? All right, I did request this on the stream and this is $78. So I'm really going to look at this further, try it on you know, again and, and just kind of see if I think it's flattering on. I do like it and like I said, I don't have a navy spring jacket so I could use it. But I'm gonna just be figuring this one out a little bit more, but this is really the only item that I am considering from this box. Everything else I will be sending back. But anyways, I do wanna thank you so much for taking a little bit of time out of your day to spend with me. I really do appreciate it, and I will see you all next time. Bye.